hi guys welcome to me and maths today in this video we will learn about simplification how to simplify the statement like this you can see in this video here like this statements or you can call this one as a expression let's see so guys here 4 plus 12 divided by 2 into 3 i have one expression here or you can call this one as a statement what i am doing first i am solving this from left side 4 plus 12 answer is 16 16 divided by 2 into then again from the left side 16 divided by 2 so 16 divided by 2 the answer is what here 8 2 into 8 is 16 into 3 8 into 3 we got the answer here 24 if we calculate from the left side we got answer 24 let us see from right side let us do the calculation from the right side so right side means you should start from here 2 into 3 so 4 plus 12 I write as it is divided by 2 into 3 answer is here again the right side I have here 12 divided by 6 first I will solve that from right side so 4 plus 12 divided by 6 so answer is 2 6 into 2 is 12 then again 4 plus 2 answer is 6 now here I got the answer 6 if I am calculating from left side, I got answer 24. If I am calculating from the right side, I got the answer 6. Now, so guys, here I got the two different answers. So, in mathematics, we cannot have two different answers for the same expression. We should have only one unique answer. Then, how we can fix this problem? How we can overcome this problem? How to solve it? To solve this type of statements or you can call as a uh, expressions we have to follow a unique rule that rule is called board mass b o d m a s board mass let us learn about the board mass by using the board mass you can get the only one unique correct answer so here let us start the board mass so b o d m a s first let us learn about this board mass what actually it is so b stands for brackets b stands for brackets in brackets again we have the order we have to maintain the order we have to follow the order as it is given in the board mask so first we have the common bracket second we have the curly bracket then we have the square bracket like this we have to follow the order if we have the bracket in the given question first we have to solve the numbers present in the bracket i will show you by taking the example first let us learn about this the order so second step is we have to follow the second order order of o stands for order of like we have the some numbers like this percentage the square root and this exponential form if we have this type of numbers in the question we have to solve this order that is the this is the second order now the third order is division if you have a division in the question then first we have to do the division then after we have to follow the order of multiplication in the same way here a stands for addition after doing after following the order of multiplication we have to follow the order of addition then s stands for subtraction finally we have to do follow the subtraction order so guys i hope you understand about this once again i repeat here b stands for brackets if brackets are there in the question first we have to uh, solve the numbers present in the bracket it means we have to open the bracket the order of bracket is first we have to open the common bracket then curly bracket then square bracket second step is i mean the second order what we have to follow order of if you have like this numbers first we have to solve them then third order is what here division we have to first do division the next we have m stands for multiplication after the division we have to look for the multiplication the next a stands for addition then after we did the multiplication now we have to do addition the finally at the end we have to do the subtraction so guys let us simplify this statement with the help of the board mass then you will get the correct answer so first what is the first step here what is the, uh, what is the first step here we have to look for the bracket we have to look for the brackets so bracket is given in the question or not just look here so here i have no bracket then what we have to do next here i have to look for the order i have to search I have to look for like this number so like this number also I don't have the next here division 
the next order is what here division first we have to do the division let's see division is there or not so in my question i have the division so this is the division 12 divided by 4 plus 12 divided by 2 the answer is what here 6 2 into 6 is 12 then write this into 3 as it is so first we fall first we did the division the next year after division so in board mass after division we have to look for the multiplication now just search in this one do we have multiplication here yes we do have multiplication here 6 into 3 so 4 plus 6 into 3 is 18 then after multiplication in board mass we have a a stands for addition now we have to do addition so clearly we have the addition here so 4 plus 18 answer is 22 so this is the correct answer so guys if you follow the board mass rules then you get the correct answer this is according to the board mass i hope it's clear for you so guys let us see some more examples using the board mass rule so here i have one statement or you can call this one as an expression so in let us see here so what we have to do we have to follow the first order that is brackets we have to look for the brackets in the question if we have the brackets then first we have to solve it let us see bracket is there or not so in my question i don't have any bracket here then go for the next order the next order is order of look for this type of numbers do we have this type of numbers or not in the question so clearly i don't have like this number in my question then again next uh, next order is division now we have to do the division look for the division in the question if you have the division then first we have to do division so now here i have the division here 14 divided by 2 first i will solve this one first i will do the division let us start 6 into 4 plus 14 divided by 2 the answer is what here 7 2 into 7 is 14 so division is finished so after division what is the order here m stands for multiplication we have to look for the multiplication if multiplication is there then we have to do multiplication let us see so here i have the multiplication here that is 6 into 4 6 into 4 is 24 plus 7 then after multiplication the order is addition now we have to look for the addition if addition is there first we have to do addition let us see so here i have the addition here so i can add these two numbers 24 plus 7 so my answer is what here 31 31 is the correct answer let us see some more example here by using the bracket now see here i have the question with the brackets let us follow the order first you have to look for the bracket first is common bracket second one is curly bracket third one is a square bracket first we have to open the common bracket let us see what type of bracket is there in our question so first order is brackets let's look for brackets so clearly i have the bracket here 14 minus 4 first i have to solve the numbers present in the brackets let us see here 7 into 5 is as it is plus 14 minus 14 minus 4 is 10 divided by 2 so first order is finished then look for the order of so like this number we don't have then next go for the division so here we have division yes we have the division here see 10 divided by 2 first let us solve that 7 into 5 plus 10 divided by 2 what is the answer it is 5 2 into 5 is 10 the next after division what we have to do here multiplication so clearly i have here multiplication 7 into 5 7 into 5 is 35 this plus 5 is so finally what is the answer here 35 plus 5 the answer is 40 guys this is really very you must know this one it can be used in the competitive exam and as well as in the school level okay guys let us see another example i have one big expression here so let us solve this with the help of board mass so first we have to start with the brackets so look at for the brackets yeah i have the brackets in my question then first i will solve this one 20 minus uh, 12 the answer is uh, answer is 8 then again okay we don't have any bracket finish now look for the o order of we don't have any order of here then go for d division so here first you write the full numbers then go for the division order so 
so i have the division here a divided by 4 the answer is 2 then write the, all the numbers here then again go for the multiplication so here i have the multiplication 2 into 3 2 in 2 into 3 is 6 6 plus 6 minus 7 then according to the board mass after multiplication we have to do addition i have the addition here 6 plus 6 is 12 minus 7 finally we have the subtraction 12 minus 7 answer is 5 so 5 is the correct answer so guys let us see one more example here 10 divided by 5 into 5 plus 5 i have one expression here let us solve with the help of the board mass so board mass starts with bracket so now here i have the brackets clearly first i have to solve the numbers present inside the bracket let us solve 10 divided by 5 into 5 plus 5 is 10 this is into sign clear then after we have to go for the o o stands for order here we don't have any order then go for d division so i have the division here 10 divided by 5 answer is 2 into 10 so after division clearly we have the multiplication let us do the multiplication 2 into 10 the answer is 20 okay guys i have here one expression this you have seen in my thumbnail right let us solve this so again the same we have to follow the board mass first is we have to uh, solve the bracket let us do it 27 divided by 3 into 2 plus 9 is 11 then after we have to look for the o here we don't have any o then here look for the d d means division then after we have to do the division 27 divided by 3 so answer is what here 9 9 into 11 equal to so our answer is 99 so guys how simple it is using the board mass you can do by your own by checking the numbers or if you uh, find like this uh, uh, statement anywhere in the mathematics you can do easily with the help of the board mass so guys you might have seen this question on this video's thumbnail right so let us solve this how to do it so guys if you observe this expression here we have the two brackets the square bracket and a common bracket now first we have to solve these brackets right so if two brackets are like this together first we have to solve the inside bracket that is a common bracket first let us solve so see here in inside the common bracket again we have the some operations here uh, separation and multiplication so here also we have to follow the board mass in opening this bracket 65 minus 5 plus 2 of now here we have separation and we have here multiplication so what the board mass says first we have to do multiplication 18 minus 2 into 6 is 12 now again we have to open the common bracket here 65 minus 5 plus 2 of 18 minus 2 is 6 clear now now we have solved the common bracket now we have to okay guys now we have to solve the numbers present inside the square bracket let us see how to do it so in square bracket also we have the some operations here addition and here off means here multiplication so here also we have to apply the board mass inside the square bracket so let us see here 65 minus 5 plus this off means you can take this one as a into so 5 plus 2 into 6 is what is here answer here 12 then again here in square bracket we have the addition first to do it addition minus 5 plus 12 how much here is 17 so 65 minus 17 the answer is 48 i hope you understand about this board mass okay guys if you really like this video please like share and comment share this video with your friends your friends may need this one and also finally please don't forget to subscribe my channel me and mass thank you